Schau, gibt es eine gute. Schau. Danke. Mach Sitz. Fein. So ist fein. Hello and welcome back. I just want to give you a short insight into the outdoor life of my new shepherd dog, Aika. I made the first video about her two weeks ago and actually I just want to show you what happened since then and what I'm actually doing with her, how I'm working with her. In the first weeks everything is new for her. So a puppy had to learn at first, where is my home? How is the area in my home, around my home? Who is family and who not? And then when she feels, she feels safe, you can go the next step. At first we had to learn each other and we had to love each other. I had to know that she had to come to me, that I am her I don't like the word, but I am her boss and she had to do what I want. And then we can do the next step and learn more um, what she had to do in, at the walk and at the forest and everything else. You can see that Aika want really to learn. So she is interested in everything. She always is looking around and I knew now that she is also hearing for different noises here in the forest. Actually she is just laying down and has fallen asleep. But when someone is coming, you see very short that she wake up and look what happened there. Is it normal or should I be afraid or should I protect? Um, I am today at the cabin and Aika knows that the area, maybe 30 meters around of the cabin, is hers. And she had to protect that, she had to watch what happened here. Um, who can come to the cabin and who is not welcome. And she's also watching when she hears a noise, maybe um, an airplane or when someone is talking around. You always see that she react and this is very good because she had to learn which noises are normal and uh, which noises means um, oh I had to protect or um, this is not normal I had to watch or I had to look if this noise come closer to me or not. The real training to a protection dog cannot start yet because she is too small. In the first month she had to play a lot because this is the childhood. So it is important that she can play and that she can be a baby puppy. And then later there came the next step. Ah, actually you can see that she is watching because an airplane is around. And then she is just laying down again because she hears the noises going back and far away and everything is fine. Um, when she is six months, the next part of her training start. Um, she had to learn everything what every dog had to learn at first. Um, and then, maybe to, from six to 12 months, this training is there and after 12 months, the real protection dog training starts because at first we had to see if she can do this, if she is interested in learning or not and how she would follow me, how we work with each other. And then when we can see that there are good chances that she can make this training, we start. But um, I'm very looking forward that she is doing it fine because she's always interested in someone new and she wants that I love her, that I told her that she's a good girl. So you can see that she really wants to learn and this is a really good sign. Nein. Ja. 
Maybe someone of you are asking why I had not with me the Dachshund 2 and this had a simple reason because actually I had to learn a lot and when we are at home all the dogs are together and then they play with each other and they are really rough and there's always trouble but not in bad trouble so there's just always action and when other dogs are around she can't really be concentrated she she had to be focused at me when she had to learn something new and when there are other dogs around she can't be focused so um, from time to time I had to be alone with her that we can really learn and um, she, she also had to to know all those normal forest noises and when there is always a dog around and they are always playing she can't learn this because then there is always action and she she had to to, to be just with me and her that there is everything silent around and no action around where she is watching so this is a better um, and this is better to learn when we are just together and nobody else. No human, no um, animal, nothing. Before we drive to the forest cabin, we were both in the pet animal shop because I want to buy a new collar. So I hope the right word is collar for this one. Um, because it is important that Ica knows the difference between normal family life at home and the outdoors work. Um, so she had to have not only the visual difference, what she's see seeing home and now we are in the forest. It is important that she have also something at her body, what changed at her body. So I want to buy another one with another color and a little bit different so that I can change it when we are going outdoors and she had to work now. But we don't find the right one now. I had to look at another shop. Maybe I find then a better one. At home she's really doing great. The kids love her and she loves the kids. Um, but of course She's a puppy and she's always trying out how much can I do, how much, how wide can I go in and where's stop. So um, you always had to show her in a lovely way where is the stop and what she can do and what not. Uh, for example, she's, um, we have here the bird is called Elster and the Elster is always stealing everything, everything what is shining. So uh, gold rings or um, aluminium, everything what is shining. And she is a little bit like this bird Elster because she is also always stealing something what is laying around, um, for example, maybe a pillow or something from the children and then She's going very, very silent and slowly to her bed and then she is um, hiding the stuff there under her blanket so that nobody can see it. And when there's nobody around, she bites it as she bites it the whole time till it is damaged. Um, or another example, um, Aika sleeps, sleeps in my sleeping room, not in my bed, because there are the cats and they don't want to have a dog inside. I'm sure they would be really angry. And of course the cat is so small and when Aika is growing up, she is so big and there is no place then for me anymore. But she sleeps um, at the end of my bed where my feet are at the ground. And she, see, she sleeps very well in the night, but in the morning when the sun comes out, she's awake. And then we had to go outside um, the first time. And then when I have enough time, I just laying down again. But she's always stealing my blanket then. Um, she also try to sleep in the bed once. So at first she's, she's sitting at the end of the bed and then she's jumping at the bed and it's going with the feet forward very closely, closely, closely till my head because she know 
she thought that I don't want I, that I don't hear it, but I put her down very shortly. So um, there had to have, be a difference where I sleep and where the dog sleeps. I sleep up and she sleep down because um, by wolfes there is it is normal that the boss wolfes are sleeping higher than the rest and she had to know that I am the boss and she's welcome in the family and she's loved but she is a little bit more down and the humans are the boss. Everything what Aika had to learn is on process so it had to take time till she can everything um, but of course this is normal She's just a puppy and it is very important that a puppy can play and just be a baby. So like a human child, they also want to play and it is very important that they can play. So I don't want to be too strong at the beginning. Mm -hmm. And um, it is absolute normal that this learning is a process and it can't be from today to tomorrow. But she is doing great. And may, may actually, we just try to show her everything what happens at her home, at the farm, show her the animals. And the next week, I do my first overnight of her. She was many hours in the forest and in the nature around, but till now, never overnight. And so I'm very curious how she would doing her first night. The last days, the last weeks are always with so much rain and I want that she have a great experience outdoors. I don't want to start with the first overnight when the area around is so uncomfortable. She likes water, but I'm sure when she had to be outside with me and it is raining all day that she don't want that she don't like it. So I'm waiting till the weather is a little bit better. And of course, then the next step is first cabin overnighter. She had to be always with me, that she always know different situations in life. In public, in the forest, at home, at the cabin, in the car. She had to know everything. I want to buy Aika now a yellow uh, string that I can put at her string um, because when a dog had something yellow at his body that means that um, other people and other dogs should not go too close to this dog because this could be could mean that this dog is in training mm -hmm. or this dog is old or ill or when it is a female mm -hmm. that she's ready to making babies so this means that other people should have a little bit distance to the dog when it is possible of course um, and it is very important at the first weeks and months that she can be really really strong in training there is nobody knows nothing around what um, is loud or in moving where she's watching it so she should always watching at me and the closer area, but it should to be quiet, that she can re learn really good. Wie schneller du oder ich? Ha? Sollen wir was abbrechen? Komm. Geht es? Eika, komm her. Komm. Mach's jetzt. Ja, fein. Schau her. Und als nächstes holst du mal den Stock, wenn du aufgefressen hast. Komm, du hast was saufen, komm. Komm her. Schau hier. Schau, du hast mal was trinken. Magst nix. Hier. Zup. Du hast heute Wasserscheu. Come. Come here. Come. Come here.
komm mit. Bist du müde? Magst du noch schlafen oder was? Ha? Du. Eika, hier. Hier. Ja, hol den den Stock, hol den. Hol den. Hier. Hier. Ja, jetzt hast du ja, jetzt hast du Stock. Super. Ha? Lass mal aus. Nein. Ja. Hol den. So, this was a little insight in the life of Aika and me. I will show you always a little bit in the future. And now we are just playing a little bit more around and doing a small walk in the forest. And you can see Aika really enjoy to be in the forest. She can bite everywhere. Um, and for me, it is always it is also a good sign when I see that she's relaxed in the forest, is not afraid. So I'm very looking forward to our adventures that we want to start with each other together. So we take a walk now and we see us in the next video. Have a great time. We see us. Bye. Ei, Kau, hast du Durst? Hm? Sollen wir nur mal schauen, ob du was magst? Komm. Magst du jetzt was? Ja, fein. So viel Durst gleich. Und vorher nichts wollen. <lacht>